The Mother is a play about a woman who is struggling through a period of her life where her children are one by one leaving the home and it's kind of questioning her purpose in life. In a way, what we're witnessing is the unravelling of a woman who is contemplating all her paranoias and suspicions and disappointments in, in her own life. It makes you question what's real and what's not real because she struggles to understand that herself. Is she causing the, her world around her to disintegrate or is it disintegrating and it's causing her to suffer? It is possibly the longest show I've ever sort of like sat with <laughs> because we've been rehearsing since um, earlier this year. It's a tough play to begin with. It's been a very, very tough play to work on. And for us to have to keep going into rehearsals and then pausing and having months of rest and then coming back to it is very hard because just as you're getting momentum in the rehearsal room, then everything has been called to a stop. Having said that, sometimes, and I like to see the glass as half full, sometimes there are some characters where you do need to live with them a little bit longer. Anne is probably one of them for me. She is very complex and written in a way that maybe is, I suspect it's actually beyond my own life experience. So hopefully that this play will bring some empathy to this stage in a person's life. You know, at, at the same time, I hope that it makes people think, makes people kind of question what mental health really means. And all the unsaid, unrevealed thoughts, emotions and mini crises that go on in, in a person's head who, who has that kind of role. Not just any mother, but someone who's kind of coming to the midpoint of her life. It has made me a lot more empathetic, I think, to, to people who have children who are leaving the home and, and it has really made me think about my own relationship with my children and how I might feel about it when that happens to me in a few years. <laughs>